Hey everybody, we're talking about the four and a half horsepower United today. I did, did a little bit of work on it, and I'm excited about it, so I wanted to show it off. Look what I finally got for it. Nice crank guard. Bought this from a fellow out in uh, upstate New York. His name is Bill Graves. I highly recommend him if anybody's looking for associated or United parts. These crank guards, they're, they're made new, and they're nicely formed, nice um, ridges and everything. And the rolled edges aren't just rolled, but there's actually a, a steel bar in there, like I don't know, a quarter-inch steel bar to give it rigidity. So it's very nice. So I painted it. I found a picture of, of a uh, really nice detail on a crank guard on a different United on the internet, so I, I copied it and I drew a, drew the design on a piece of paper. I scribbled pencil on the back of the paper to make like a carbon paper transfer almost, and I put the paper down there, taped it down, aligned it, and then I traced over the design and the, the pencil that I scribbled on the back of that paper transferred onto the sheet metal here, so then I was able to paint over it. So I think that came out pretty well. Again, that's uh, Caterpillar yellow paint, same as all the other pinstriping. The only problem that I had, and Bill Graves said that this was a problem with some of the crank guards, is that you'll see that I have a little add-on piece there on the very bottom because it just it just didn't didn't uh, match up. And I tried bending the the crank guard down, but it just smooshed the entire thing too much so I I just made that little extra piece and screwed it on and it's it's pretty pretty subtle you really can't see it I mean especially you know you stand back like that you're not looking at it at that little piece so oh that's the only only uh bad side I guess or a negative thing about the crank guard but uh it's really not that big of a deal but anyway there she, there she is pretty much all done now the only thing left to do, I need still need to find a tag for it, and I need to paint United on the side of the water hopper. Anyway, that's it, guys. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this. <clears throat> and uh, as always, stay tuned for more.